Pediatrician Musa Mohammed Nordin prepares a vaccine and administers it to a less than pleased child. But health officials here in Muslim majority Malaysia are worried as more and more parents opt out of immunization programs for religious reasons. Malaysian Health Minister S. Subramanian. Our concern is if left uncontrolled, uh, what will happen in the long term if these numbers continue to increase and then, uh, then it might have a significant effect on the health of the nation as a whole. Misinformation within the Muslim community is rampant that some vaccines contain ingredients like pig DNA, which is forbidden by Islam. Malaysia's highest Islamic body says vaccines with non-halal components are allowed when alternatives aren't available. Still, some parents aren't convinced. A recent forum on the benefits of vaccines left some skeptical. Parents don't know where to turn when there are adverse effects from vaccines, this parent said. They have to use other methods like alternative therapies. Officials say five children have died from diphtheria since June.